Welcome to Svet's Paper Theater, episode 5. Wow, I feel like I should celebrate. I honestly don't think it would last this long. Uh, but episode 5, wow. And uh, today I will draw an elf in a tree um, in my favorite little program, Art Rage. Uh, this is version 2.5, but they have number 4 out already. I have that on my other machine. I highly recommend it. I love the, uh, I love the pencil tool in this uh, and the interface and the paper texture that they provide for your drawings. You may be wondering when will the music start and she will stop talking. Um, today the music will not start because I couldn't find a song long enough uh, for this clip. So I will just keep talking for a little bit uh, before I run out of things to say and stop and there will be silence. Before that happy point though, I'd like to direct your attention to the screen. I'm going to explain something uh, in case anyone's not familiar with this program, with how it works. Uh, so I did my underdrawing, uh, the, s the rough sketch, on one layer, and then I dropped the opacity on it and made another layer on which I then drew the, uh, the shading and the final details of the drawing. Uh, and this is the amazing thing about two paper, uh, paper 2.0. Um, you can do that. You can just then make the la the sketch layer invisible, and you're only left with your uh, with your final detailed drawing uh, on the other layer. Uh, on in real life, on paper, you could not do that. Uh, you would have to if you make a mistake, you have to work some real magic with an eraser, uh, trying to not mess up the any of the other lines. So this. I really like Paper 2.0 and highly recommend it. Uh, the elves uh, have a very special place in my heart ever since I read uh, Mr. Tolkien's uh, Lord of the Rings at a very impressionable age. And the funny thing is I actually read only the first book at first and I didn't know that there were two more. Uh, so I thought that that was the end. They they separated and went off in different directions. Uh, and it was, I think, a couple of years until I actually got to read the rest and find out that, hey, things didn't really get better. Uh, but else, obviously, struck a chord uh, with my young, impressionable heart, and I started drawing them forever and ever and have not stopped since. And... I'm not sure what this particular elf is doing uh, in a tree, looking so intent, but I think this elf is an archer. <laughs> what do you think? It is possible that I may have forgotten to draw the actual bow uh, in this drawing. I guess I got a little too distracted by the designs on this lovely thing with the uh, arrows. I forget what it's called. The thing. Oh, perhaps the bow was dropped at some point. And now the elf is searching for it. I don't even know. All these stories, all these pictures probably have stories. And if they don't, they should. And that's the tree. I always was really, really bad with shading in school. I just, I didn't understand where uh, the whole concept of light sources. So I would just put stuff, put shadows randomly uh, where I felt they looked right. Uh, and then my teachers would disagree about it looking right and my, I would be marked accordingly. Uh, I have gotten a little better since then, but it still confuses me a lot. I probably messed up the shading in this one too. I already see so many mistakes, which I will not point out because if you can't see them, that's great. Carry on. <laughs> this 
so much shading. This can really hurt your hand if you're uh, doing these repetitive strokes for a while. After I finished Witch and Wizard, I actually had to rest my hand for a couple of months. It was so hurting badly after all the cross hatching I had to do in the Shadowland chapter. It took a while to recover. More shadows. I wish I could draw this fast. This is actually four times the speed of uh, the actual drawing. The actual drawing was about 27 minutes. Uh, but I didn't want to make people sit through the entire thing. Seven minutes is plenty. Leaves are also okay to draw. Actually, everything is a pain to draw. Why do I do this to myself? No, I lied. This was fun. And there it is, all done.